Today we're decoding glaucoma, the mysterious guest that increases the pressure in your eye. I'm Doc Cash, a consultant ophthalmologist at your service. Now, what is glaucoma? In simple terms, it's a group of eye conditions that damage the optic nerve, crucial for good vision. The key word here is a group, it's not a single disease. This damage is often caused by abnormally high pressure in your eye. Imagine your eye is a basketball, too much pressure and it's going to be game over for the ball. Similarly, too much eye pressure in your vision starts getting lost. But here's a kicker, not all types of glaucoma have a high pressure. Normal tension glaucoma has a normal pressure but causes glaucomatous symptoms. If so far you've liked this video, consider giving us a like and subscribe to promote this video to viewers like yourself. Time for some science. What's the deal with that pressure? Well, your eye produces a fluid called aqueous humor. It basically acts as the blood in your eye providing nutrients to different structures. It's supposed to flow out of your eye through a drainage system that's between your cornea and your iris. But in primary open angle glaucoma, this system is like that clock sink in your kitchen. The fluid doesn't drain right, pressure builds up, and your optic nerve starts getting damaged. Now, recently, we've discovered other ways glaucoma affects your eye. But one of the more important ones is the vascular theory, which shows one of the ways glaucoma progresses is a lack of blood supply to your optic nerve. This becomes important when we start dealing with the treatment, more on that later. Let's zero in on the most common type, primary open angle glaucoma. It shows no signs until there are moderate to advanced symptoms. This type of glaucoma creeps up on you. No pain, no early symptoms. That's why annual eye exams are so important. We have amazing tools at our disposal that let us diagnose glaucoma before any symptoms appear. Eventually, you start witnessing narrowing of your vision. You lose part of your peripheral vision, which gradually then goes in all the quadrants. Then you have something called tunnel vision. Eventually, you lose the central vision as well and get irreversible blindness. That is key, irreversible. Now that we've scared you, let's talk about some solutions. Remember one key fact, glaucoma is irreversible. Once the damage is done, it cannot be taken back. But the good news? We can manage it very effectively. We have eye drops, laser treatments, and surgery. Modern medicine has a full toolkit. It's all about keeping that pressure down and letting your optic nerve chill. For lasers, we have something called selective laser trabeculoplasty, which in today's line is the first line therapy. Then we have drops that can lower pressure. Then when nothing works, we have surgical options. In fact, today's surgical options are available even in early stages, especially for those undergoing cataract surgery. Specialized tubes are placed inside the eye to lower the pressure and your dependence on drops. Now remember we talked about that lack of blood supply theory? That's important in a bunch of ways, but the most important is if you are taking blood pressure medications. Make this known to your doctor as it can be silently making your glaucoma worse. Also, all anti-glaucoma medications make your dry eye worse, and that's one of the reasons today we emphasize non-drop treatments. However, still, regular checkups are the real MVPs. Catching glaucoma early is like catching that piece of broccoli in your teeth. A lot of embarrassing, but a total save. Even after the diagnosis, we must keep an eye on you with regular follow-ups to see that you're not progressing. So there you have it folks, glaucoma, the silent sight snatcher, unmasked. Remember, it's sneaky, but you can be sneakier with regular eye exams. If you liked today's video, please give us a like and subscribe to catch all our vision knowledge. If you have any questions, please leave us the comments below.